Hi guys, I hope you are well. Today's video is a little bit different. Um, this is going to be a video based on baby stuff. Because um, as you know, I'm 35 weeks pregnant at the moment. So not long until baby gets here. Um, so I'm just going to show you what we've sort of got set up upstairs so far and like just go through like the organisation that I've done and stuff because I, I found these videos helpful to watch myself so I just thought it'd be good to give um, people ideas and sometimes people just like watching those sort of things anyway so I'll get the camera off me and we'll start sh I'll start showing you the stuff. <laughs> okay, so in our room this is the set up for the sleeping so none of this stuff is obviously going to be in there when the baby actually sleeps in there it's just at the minute like decoration sort of thing there's a mini fridge um down there that we'll probably sort out for like bottles and things if we end up bottle feeding this um was gifted to us this will not be used for sleep that'll be coming out the pillow will obviously come out um the pillow is from primark and then my family got us that little lamb for an easter present that will obviously come out as well so all that will be left is the sheet um and this is a winnie the pooh sheet i can't actually remember where i think the winnie the pooh sheet was from Denelm in the uk and then we have this Noah's Ark um, baby mobile. So it's got it's got the different all the different stuff on it, the different animals and things. Um, and that was from Jojo Mum and Baby. Don't know why it's not focusing, but I can't pronounce. Um, that the place that it came from there you go jojo mum and baby not very good at pronouncing stuff but um yeah the mobile did come with a little thing that spins it with music and stuff but it just made it too low um but yeah that's our crib set up and then there's storage space underneath the cribs from ikea and we've just put um a light on the wall so that in the night it's just easy to see things. Um, and then this is the baby's nursery. Um, obviously they won't be in this for a while. Um, in the UK it's recommended that they stay in our room for at least six months. We might try to do the full year. Um, but we'll see how they get on with their sleeping and stuff. So over here we've got the changing unit. So... My partner made, this is like a Ikea chest of drawers, and my partner made the changing table to like sit over the top, so um, it's just like wooden slats put together with, and then we've painted it, um, so at least like when they're bigger we can just take the, um, take this bit off and just use it as normal drawers. So we've got a Winnie the Pooh sticker up there, a Winnie the Pooh uh like photo picture frame thing the little nappy caddy over there change them out i haven't taken out of the plastic yet um and then we've just got some bits on the floor so like the bath will be going downstairs this um play gym will be going downstairs this will be going downstairs it's just that it's in the room at the moment our push chair is underneath that blanket there's a travel cot, um, we've got a box of blankets, a box, a little basket of different blankets and stuff there and then these are just our organisation drawers with different bits in so like bath supplies, nappies, postpartum stuff for me. Up here we've got um, like the bottle warmer, a Google Nest. The VTEC camera and the grow egg um, and then some random bits on there that I want to do and sort out with them. I made made this um, for the push chair. Please wash your hands before holding and no kisses. Thank you. So I just made the design and printed it out and laminated and laminated it and stuff. So 
we've got that going on. I need to put it on the push chair. Um, up here we've got Winnie the Pooh lamp, Winnie the Pooh train, um, and then some more Winnie the Pooh stickers. We're renting, so we're quite limited of what we can do to the walls and stuff. We've got Winnie the Pooh curtains, like the little classic Winnie the Pooh ones, they're quite nice. Some more stickers, and then we've got the Winnie the Pooh characters all along there. And then this yellow shelf is not part of this bookcase. My partner actually put it on, built it onto himself because we can't put shelves on the wall. So this was our next best idea. We've got a mixture of books. So we've got like the smaller books for like the pram, like the soft style books, um, sensory sort of books. The touch and feel books. Um, there's some Makaton books um, and some Welsh children's books. Um, and then Little Elephant is holding some more books here. So we've got some more Welsh books, um, Makaton, some more sensory books, stuff like that. This was gifted to us, and so was this chair, little sit up chair. And then this is our rocking chair and then this teddy here has the baby's heartbeat sound in it which is what we when we went to the ultrasound we had that made um, and then I put these little hooks on the side of the pallax unit so that we could hang a couple of coats and things on there because once again we can't put any sort of hooks or shelves and stuff up. So that's what it the nursery looks like. And then in terms of organisation, so this is our top, the top drawer. So we've got size one nappies here, and then I've just put like a little blanket to divide down the middle because these are size two nappies and then we've got water wipes well they're the aqua the aqua wipes i think pampers can't remember um and then just some more wipes there we've got a reusable nappy i think we've got two or three of those um and then we've just got like some cotton buds some creams some nappy sacks this is like a cream applicator like spreader tool and this is the snoozer hero um which tracks their like breathing and stuff like that so that's our top organization drawer the second drawer is a little bit messy because i washed all these clothes and um quickly like folded them back up and stuff the other day um so this box, this box, and this box are first size. Um, like up to one month size, sorry, not first size. So we've I've made like little labels to say like what's in each um, one. This is probably, definitely not going to stay this organised, but it's helpful for the moment. So we've just got like a couple of sort of that size, because I don't know, they're not going to be in it very long. And then this side is zero to three we have a lot of zero to three because we did get a lot of zero to three gifted to us um but they're probably not gonna wear all of those because they'll grow out of it too quick but i'm hoping to use some of the zero to three alongside the up to one month um initially as well so hopefully we'll get through them even if i change them a couple of times a day just to wear the outfit <laughs> And then the next drawer down. That's getting stuck because I think, yeah, we only had those ones the other day, so I haven't actually folded those and put them away yet. <laughs> um, so these are the bigger sizes, like, none of these have been washed, like, they've still got labels on and stuff. So you've got like three to six months um, 
is here and then six to nine months is in this one um, and the drawer organizers are these white boxes here they they are from Ikea um, so you can get those in I think a pack of seven or six um, the different organizers so you can kind of just slot them in how you want um, so I feel like they're really handy rather than just having it all sort of thrown into the drawer and then our last drawer is this one so we've got crib sheets over here um, in this one we've got muslins in this one and there's a couple of muslins on the top of there because they wouldn't fit in there um, but this one is like bath towels and like a couple of bibs um, and then we've got like the little bits in here so like hats, socks, mittens in that one and then we've got a couple of little bits of like shoes um, down in just that gap there um, this back one is sleep sleep bags so there's about four or five sleep bags in there and then this middle one is like bandana bibs so I don't know how we've ended up with so many of those but I'm sure we'll go through them <laughs> they'll come in handy so that's what our drawer organisation looks like and then in the boxes that were underneath the crib we have like some bigger sizes um, that will go into these drawers when when they're done um, and I've got to say as well we've got the lights on the wall here as well so that in the night we put the main um, light on in the when I'm coming in to change them and stuff we won't need to put the main light on so yeah that's what our our situation currently looks like we're pretty much done um this was from Lidl but yeah we're nearly getting there and it's just crazy how fast it's coming but I hope you guys like just seeing a little bit of this if you have any video ideas or video requests please let me know um and I'll see you soon I hope you're all doing well bye